Dial Tracking Nomad Slim Wallet is on the desk today and it smells so good. So stick around. Welcome to Walletopia. We appreciate you being here. Please go to walletopia.info to register. You won't regret it. And remember, Walletopia is where you go when you want to know anything and everything there is about the world of wallets. We purchase every wallet we review. Now, we reviewed this wallet previously, but it didn't have the tracking tile in it. It's back with the tracking tile, so let's get into it. This is Nomad's Slim Wallet with tile tracking. I'm sure you're all familiar with tile tracking and what those do. And um, incorporating technology into wallets seems to be something that is still all the rage these days. So if we open this up, it's a nice, nice packaging. It's very retail-esque in uh, how it's presented to us. And we have this very nice kind of a ultra suede or just kind of a nice little pouch here. Looks like we've got the instructions here, especially on how to work with the tile, how to connect it. It does work with a phone app that you have. And here is the wallet itself. This is a brown Horween leather, but it also comes in black. And this is obviously where the tile is. Let's listen. Nice. At which point that's how you connect it to your phone. Horween leather. Man, this is really great for that. This will develop a wonderful patina over time. Look at the stitching on this. It's done well. Nice burnishing. Just a nice looking wallet. Now onto the feature review. Whoa. Now onto the feature review of the Nomad Slim Tile Tracking Wallet. As we look at this wallet from the exterior, we have one quick access card slot right here. Love these. I think every wallet should have something like that, especially these days with credit cards. If we go to the interior, we notice that on the right hand side, we have one, two, three, we have four card slots here. Cash could also go in this last one here. Uh, so there's definitely three card slots. On the right hand side, this is where it says to activate your tile. It's nice instructions. <clears throat> and the tile itself is in this rear slot here, which we'll look at more closely. And we have yet another card slot right here. So quite a bit of card capacity. And you can also put cash back here as well. And we'll show that in the card and cash insertion test. That is a quick review of the features of the Nomad Slim Wallet with Tile Tracker. Now to the card and cash insertion test. As you saw, I got six cards in there and four slips of cash. And that, those slips of cash, those notes fit just fine on there. And uh, business cards, hey, let's look at the business cards. Have a few business cards here. Looks like business cards fit just fine in any of the card slots that we have. So it looks like we are good for business cards. From a minimalist perspective, probably four cards is reasonable. Seven is fine, honestly. Uh, the company indicates it can hold up to 12 cards. It's pretty good. Now, from a quality perspective, and that's what is very important with this particular wallet, is that it's made in the United States from Chicago Horween leather. And, oh man, yeah, it smells awesome. This is a full grain veg tan leather. It has some creasing that we can see right here on all the pockets. And that is a that is a feature of, of the design itself and something that takes extra effort. So that's just not something that happens. So that's a, you know, an attention to detail. All right, I've removed all the cards here uh, so that we can take a look at the tile. So let's, let's get a look at the inside of this where the tile fits. All right, you can get a good view here if I put a light on this about where the tile is. And there's this elastic space right here. And in this elastic space is where there is a little pocket. And in this little pocket is right where this tile lives. So if we pull that out, right here, yeah, yeah. it's in there pretty good. Here we go. Here's the tile. This is big. I mean, let's let's be honest about how big this tile is. And I think they've done a great job in 
putting this in there in as, as little a footprint as possible so it's not so noticeable. Uh, but this, uh, this is a great idea, especially if you're kind of a klutz and you tend to lose your wallet often, kind of like how people drop their phones all the time. But if uh, you get concerned about, well, what if, I ha what if I happen to buy this and then all of a sudden it dies? Well, they do die in about a year. But Nomad has a retile program, which provides you a discount for additional tiles. So if we look at how this goes back in, nice little pocket in here is just a elastic sleeve. It just kind of fits right down here. You pull the top up over it, and then it's all tucked away in here nicely again. Can't even see it. Again, you can put cards in here, you can put cash in here, not really a problem. And when it's uh, time to activate, you press it. And what it does is it then connects to the app that you install on your phone, at which point then it's tracking it for you. The price on this is $79, and it is very easy to use. The leather feels good, as you'd expect from Horween leather. And Nomad has done a great job of taking very specialized leather expensive leather, something you typically only see with hand-stitched, hand-crafted uh, wallets, and putting them into kind of short-run production, something that would be normally you'd think of mass production, but it's really short-run production using this high quality of a leather. So they've continued the search for quality and they've really made it work here. Measurements on this is four inches by three by 0.5, and it weighs 54 grams. Oh, there it goes, I didn't connect it, so it started to be off. Anyway, I like the quality of Nomad products and many of their customers wish they'd make additional models of wallets to choose from due to their quality, longevity, and usability. People ask that all the time. They produce just a couple models. And they also produce an extensive product line for travel and outdoor-minded folks beyond just the wallets. So take a look at their website and see what they have for you. So now let's get on to the final score. For quality of four, price a three, features a four, usability a three, and perception a five. That gives us a final score of 37 out of 50. If you want to see all the rest of the rankings of wallets that we've done on this channel, you can go to walletopia.info slash rankings or click on the tile up above. And we'll talk to you again soon. Thanks, bye.